The main works are the construction of a critical care unit and the construction of a helipad on an adjacent building. The main work package would be enabling works, diversion of mechanical electrical service to allow us to construct the new building, substructure pile foundations, steel frame, the external envelope, the fit out of the mechanical plant rooms and two floors of critical care unit. The construction methodology for the critical care unit is quite unique. We're essentially building a structure up and then building from top down over the existing theatre block. The theatre block will remain live at all times and all our operations will take that into consideration. The main challenge are twofold. Firstly, it's logistics, actually building the building. We are a very confined site, we're landlocked, we have a network rail asset on one side of us and a live hospital all around us. To overcome that, we erected two tower cranes, and loading bay gantries, and we have strict control of access and vehicle movement through the site. One of the key challenges that we have is working and liaison with the hospital. The hospital works for 24 hours a day, seven days a week, carrying out life critical operations. Everything we do, we have to consider that fact. To mitigate risk to the hospital's operations, we communicate on a weekly, daily and hourly basis if necessary. We have a number of mitigation methodologies in place to ensure that everything we do is safe and doesn't affect the operations of the hospital. McLaughlin Abbey would specialise in delivering this type of project. We tend to identify the needs of the project and build a team around that need to deliver a successful project. We have a close working relationship with our clients and the project teams around us.